This is Al from Crystal Eye Care. So uh, we're gonna go over in this video how to adjust the Tosis crutch. So Tosis crutches always should have this bend right here. It's basically on the top here, uh, should basically contour the top of your brow. Um, that is done by doing this. With your thumbs, push to either increase or with your index finger and thumb, bring it down, decreasing it. Uh, so that's one adjustment that's done. The other adjustments are typically um, up and down. So they're meant to do that. They are meant to bend and to be adjusted to the proper location. Um, the other adjustment is uh, in and out. So for example, we have them at this point right now with your index fingers and, and thumb, just push in. Now uh, it's preferable to push it in so that the most of the material that when you, uh, when you uh, take them out, try to bend it towards the side. So that way most of the material ends up towards the edge and it doesn't create a, uh, doesn't pinch the the uh, bridge of your nose. So, so when you put them in, just push it in with your uh, thumbs and just kind of guide it so that if it, as it collapses, it goes more towards the, the temporal area. To make them come out, so now you see that they're flattened, to make them come out, again, same, same thing as if you're gonna push them, but just bring them out by by, uh, with your uh, index and thumb and you should be able to bring them out you can do it that way as well you hold them out and eventually you should be able to place it into the section located between the brow and the eyeball uh, preferably don't put it on the eyeball uh, because that will hurt uh, over time uh, you kind of want you want to just uh, enough to wedge the skin that's really all it's holding up. And to that end, we also provide, or it's recommended, to use something like a croaky or some kind of object that allows the glasses to be stationary because um, it does provide a forward pressure. So that way it doesn't slide down your face uh, while it's trying to hold up your lid. So, um, and again, uh, bring to your local optician uh, any adjustments that you need to make prior to wearing them as that will help only help uh, make the glasses stay on your face longer and more comfortable. Um, if necessary, um, you don't want your Tosis crutches to be like this where they're visible too high up. What that means is this needs to go higher. This, that means that this is too low. So your optician would have to bring these in and then lower them so that they're more in line with your face. The last uh, adjustment is a little bit harder to explain, but essentially it boils down to this. I don't know if it can be seen, but essentially the Tosis crutch should, um, if well, not should, it's preferable to have it bow like this a little bit because some people have their eyes uh, set in and the if it goes straight out, it will uh, hit into the brow. So there's not a direct line uh, towards that part of the eye. So having it that way um, allows it to hit the that part of the eye without uh, hurting this section right over here. Most people will not have to do this, but in case you did, that is what we're looking for. We're looking for basically it to kind of be like this, so that way when you move it up and down, your brow is not being hit by the toes and scratch. If you have any questions, feel free to text us at 732 615-9300 or email us at crystal eye care nj as in new jersey at gmail.com and i'd be happy to answer any questions thank you until next time